Like like I said yesterday, I'm just out here having fun. Like uh, coming off the bench, starting it honestly doesn't matter. I'm just trying to come off, uh, have, give off a ton of energy, do pretty much do everything on both sides, and you know it's just a part of the game I'm getting used to right now. I put in a lot of work for it, and you know it's paying off right now. Obviously, I'm trying to pick spots on the court. Uh, some situations where I know I can have a mid-range shot. That's what I'm trying to say. Pull, uh, find open guys. You know, it's it's just something that I'm trying to keep the pace going. I'm trying to. I saw yesterday I was speeding up a little bit. Today I kind of slowed down a little bit. Let the game come to me. And uh, on the offensive side, you know, I'm just that's all I'm trying to do. Just let the game come to me. Uh, just how have you seen him kind of improve at his rhythm and getting into his spots? Because in these first two games, it just looks really smooth for him getting to those mid-range shots. Yeah, I mean, he's, he's, he's a natural scorer. You know, that's what he did in college. And, and you know, it's, it's, it's one of those gifts you can't really teach. You can figure out how to get guys to spots. You can, you can work on mechanics, and obviously that improves things. But uh, he just has a natural knack, you know, of scoring and, and, and knowing how to get to where he wants to get to and get a shot off. So, um, you know, again, it, it was on full display tonight. Um, but I'm going to say his defensive ability, you know, his awareness um, and his eagerness to get a stop was uh, was even more important and encouraging for me and for us. And, uh, you've shown a really good feel in these two games for getting to your spots in the mid range. How do you think you've improved on that in the past year with ball handling pace and just finding those little spots? You know, it's it was something that I kind of got a chance to watch, especially this year with Devin and Chris. They got a chance. They picked their spots. You know, they do an excellent job. They're one of the best mid range shooters to me and, and about to be an all time. Uh, but, you know, having those guys being able to do that and me also working on those uh, different type of shots and situations. And uh, right now I'm still getting the hang of it. Obviously I missed a couple of mid range jump shots today, but I know I'm just gonna get back in the gym and keep working on it. Uh, pretty much, it's just the NBA. It's a make or miss league. Uh, like, they, like you say, you can't get down on yourself. I kind of got down on myself on my shots, but at the end, my team picked me back up. I picked myself back up. And I knew even though my shots wasn't falling, another way I could impact it was on defense and trying to grab every board, every, every rebound that come off the board. And that's what I stuck with. Uh, I, take it, I take it real heavily because obviously being a skinny kid always growing up, people was always pushing me around on rebounds. And I took that personal. And I didn't want to really want to be pushed around. And I wanted to pretty much try to bully everybody on the board as a, in that case. So that's why I just stick to that. And like pretty much one of my strong suits is just trying to jump over everybody and grab the rebound. Jalen, a couple of things um, you already asked about, you know, not being able to hit shots in the first half, but it was a lot of those was offensive rebounds where you weren't able to put them back. And that obviously changed in the second half. What do you feel like doing anything differently in the second half? Or was it just sticking with it? So I was just sticking with it. I mean, pretty much. I know it's like I had like maybe three offensive rebounds that just rolled out in the first half. And I mean, that's the game of basketball. You, you can't get away from that. But uh, pretty much in the second half, I just did the same thing and just they they rolled in this time. So I mean that's 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 just the game of basketball. You you love it sometimes and you hate it sometimes, but you got to play it. And he 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 gave a pretty consistent effort. You know, okay. it's again it's it's one of those nights. That unfortunately, none of us shot it well, uh, and, and we were looking for for answers and solutions, trying to find ways to get easier buckets. But you know, we got into the actions we wanted to get into. Uh, we generated some pretty good looks. You know, in the in the paint on the rim from three, it just wasn't able to convert. So it, it was kind of a, a, a systematic thing in a way. And, and and again, I'm I'm encouraged and happy that he had a pretty good effort, um, that he showed some tenacity and some grit.